Graham was dead to begin with. There was no doubt whatever about that. His match slip had been signed by the head judge, the tournament organiser and Cameron himself, who had Graham down on three life with a vent sentinel and three other defenders in play. Old Graham was dead as a doornail. Wow, I am super dead. All right, thanks for the games. Oh, hey, before you go, are you coming to the party tomorrow? We're going to be drafting Iconic Masters, we're going to do a gift exchange, and there's going to be food. Food like we're ordering pizza, or food like a ridiculous menu of themed snacks? Oh, man, the themed snacks are going to be off the hook. Apart from anything else, we got all five Praetors. Eggish Nog Grand Beverage, Shortbread Whispering One, Gin Gatonicus, Ura Brassicas in the Hidden Ranch, and Vorse and Tex-Mex. Hard pass. Wh huh? I wish to be left alone. Why? Not this time, Stark. No party means no snacks, no tiresome games, and most importantly, no costumes. Why would I have costumes at a Christmas party? Because you have a flawless record of contriving new ways of humiliating your guests. Well, I, I mean, I did buy everyone a bunch of ugly Christmas sweaters, but I would hardly call these costumes. And check it, this one lights up. Bah humbug to your party. I, well... Merry, Merry, Merry Christmas. I'm not... I'm not Graham. I'm a spirit. What? You... you died? No. I mean... not yet, anyway. You're going to die? We're all going to die. Look, I'm here to warn you. About you dying? About being a jerk. Stop... being a jerk. What? Yeah, man. Like, sometimes you're a real butthole and it's crappy for everybody. You're not real. Of course I'm not real. But I also kind of am, and I'm here to warn you about being a dumb jerk. Because I've been that dumb jerk and it's no fun. This is your wake-up call. It's 10 p.m. You don't believe in me, do you? Why would I? You show up in my house at night, claiming to be a ghost, but probably not? And I'm the jerk? You, sir, are indigestion. Yes, uh, a, a bit of moldy cheese or, or stale tofu. Why, there's more of gravy than of graveyard to you. I mean, probably, who doesn't like gravy? Look, my dude, tonight you will be visited by a veritable procession of specters. Two one ones, a two two, and a four four with death touch. Heed the advice of these lingering souls, lest ye be cast into exile. Listen here, Geist of St. Daft. Get yourself out of my house, or we're gonna... Okay. Ah! Hello! Hi! Who are you? We're ghosts! No! Spirits! We're spirits of Top Deck's past! What? We're here to show you echoes of your magic past! When times were better and your heart was full! Oh. In a strad. No. Watch. Uh, Ultimate Jace the Mind Sculptor? I have a question for you. Go on. How did you fate seal me for seven turns and not realize that I'm on doomsday? <laughs> oh, that was the day Alex got out of blue. Oh, he traded me that chase for a place at lava spikes and a heavily played rift bolt. <sighs> I think we made a mistake. I agree. Memory misfire. Oh well, easily fixed. On to the next one. Activate Soulfire Grandmaster. Please don't. Casting Jer's Time Walk. Not like this. Passing turn to myself. In response, I am sad. Stifle. Wait, these were your happier times? Jeez, wow. Mm. I steamrolled this guy so hard he didn't come back to YJ for four months. That's not okay. Nelson had to talk him out of giving away his collection. And you wonder why you've got ghosts, spirits. Next memory! Uh, counterbalance trigger revealing Vendillion clique. You 
didn't reveal a card. I don't need to. I deterministically ordered my library four turns ago. Um... So, do you have a shuffle effect, or would you just prefer to scoop now? Hey, do you want to watch some memories from your childhood? Oh, could we? I necropotenced this one kid so hard his mom brought it up at a PTA meeting. Oh, wow, look at the time, gotta go. Next ghost, please, spirit. Bye. Hey, man. Yo. Oh. I know, right? It's great. I could just be here. I get to all the GPs. Oh, hey, you want to play some magic? Commander, draft, I'm pretty much up for whatever. What's with the fake beard? Oh, right, sorry. I am the ghost of Top Deck's present. No? Who doesn't like a bit of cosplay? Oh, I have something to show you. Uh... Frillo, I have this sweet modern bro I want to test out, or we could Winston draft. Why are we still at the moon base? Oh, they're preparing for the draft party. You should see this. We can play after. Well, I'm bummed Cam isn't coming. Yes, but on the upside, Cam isn't coming. Ouch. Well, am I wrong? He's just gonna complain about themed snacks and getting cut on blue. Well, it's because everybody always cuts him on blue. That's because he always forces blue. Look, I guess I'm a little bummed, but with Serge's leg acting up, we can do a six-person draft. Otherwise, I'd be really annoyed. You know, I'm kind of coming around on your not really missing him angle. That's a hot take I can get behind. Wow, what did I ever do to them? You want a list? Uh, nah. Hey, do you want to try that deck now? I could go for a game. Nah, dog, that's time in the round. I gotta go before the next go shows up. Wait, why? He's really tall. It makes me uneasy later, man. Ah, you must be the spirit of top decks yet to come. No, I I'm Marshall. Oh? We've, we've met. Oh, right. Yeah, at the, are you still here to show me my, uh, my, my magic future? Oh, right, yes. What is this? Next year's Boxing Day draft. Why aren't they drafting? The empty seat at the end of the table. Holy crap. Did somebody die? Wait, where am I? Did I die? Am I gonna die? I mean, we're all gonna die. I don't know why you're so obsessed with that. Anyway, no. In this moment, you're simply not there. That's your seat, but you've stopped showing up. Without you as their eighth, they can't fire the Boxing Day draft. I'm a monster. Oh, come on. They're gonna get bored and start cracking packs. How can I fix this? Spirit, Marshall, how can I make this right? I don't know, man. Maybe stop being such a wad all the time? Cameron awoke, and the bed was his own. Best and happiest of all, the time before him was his own. You there, boy! Hi, Cameron. What day is it? Thursday? Then I haven't missed it. No, it... Happens every week. Do me a favor and go to the grocery store. Buy me all the themed snacks and bring them to draft night. The Dirkwood butter tarts? The pump and pie and the Sarah Angel food cake? Yes, and a dozen mind scones. What about the Simic slaw? Yes, even the Simic slaw. The Simic slaw. The Simic sl No, you know what? Skip the slaw. On it! Cameron was better than his word. He did it all, and infinitely more. He ate the snacks, and even helped tidy up booster wrappers. He never had cause to see spirits again, but ran into Marshall once or twice at the occasional Grand Prix, and it was always said of him that he knew how to be a good friend and planeswalker if any man alive possessed the knowledge. At least, for a month or two. Then he somewhat slid back to his old ways, because, let's be honest, he's a real person, and not a character from a book. But he wasn't as cranky about themed snacks, and even voluntarily played green at pre-releases from time to time, so it wasn't a total loss. <clears throat> and so say all of us, good luck and have fun.
Happy holiday, everyone. May all of your top decks be sick, and all of your rares be bombs.